will become mostly sunny here by the afternoon hours. Look for high temperatures to get back to the mid 40s. Probably going to feel like the upper 30s, but winds are not going to be a major issue like what we saw yesterday when we kept highs only to the 30s and 40s. Now, overnight, uh, clear skies continue. We'll start off at around 30 tomorrow morning. And then increasing clouds through the day on Thursday. Widespread highs in the 50s, but do expect to see at least a chance for a stray shower or two south of I 80 by Thursday afternoon. This is like the start of our active pattern here for the rest of the week. We're really eyeing on Friday night, Saturday morning for the chance for some rain and or snow. Now, of course, this all depends on the track of the system. A further northerly track means a very cold rain across our area with a half to full inch of rain, which is a significant amount considering where we're at in the calendar. If it tracks further south, this means it could be mainly a wet snow event for the area, which could warrant our first first alert day here of the year. So a lot of questions will be answered in the upcoming days. That storm system still over the Pacific Ocean. So once we get it on shore here by Thursday, we'll have a really uh, better idea of the track and the strength. So kind of just sit tight and wait for that forecast and do know Saturday could be one of those days where travel could be a little bit hectic here in the Midwest.